Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is an Asus Transformable P100, which is a 10.1 inch tablet, which has a keyboard dock, which makes it look a lot like a netbook. Uh, it's thin, light, uh, weighs about 2.4 pounds together, 1.2 pounds in just the tablet. Feels pretty good in the hand, and it uh, is going to sell for about $349. Now, the keyboard is a little bit small, sort of like you would get with a 10-inch netbook, because it's just the width of the uh, tablet display, and the touchpad is pretty small, but in terms of touch responsiveness, it's pretty good. Um, I saw the, the uh, boot and shutdown speeds are pretty good, and um, overall, it's a uh, pretty impressively little device. So let's take a quick look and see sort of what makes it tick. It's, uh, you can see that there's a latch here that holds the device together. On the tablet itself, we've got a micro SD card slot, micro HDMI, micro USB, and on the other side, uh, volume and power buttons. There's a USB 3.0 port full size on the base station. We'll open it back up again here. And you can see that you can use the keyboard as soon as it's docked. So, this is our oh, thank you. And Use the touch screen at any point as well. And let's go ahead and undock it here. It's going to be hard to do with one hand. There we go. Knocking things over because I'm trying to do this while holding the camera. Uh, but you get the basic idea. So thin, light, feels pretty good in the hand. Uh, screen rotation has always been a little slow on Windows tablets, but it's not too bad here. And works in desktop mode, runs desktop applications because it's full Windows. 8.1 as opposed to Windows RT, and then easy to dock. Again, easier with two hands, but it's got front and rear cameras, and we're docked and pulls together pretty nicely. So um, overall, it's sort of the evolution of a netbook uh, with an Intel Atom Bay Trail processor, two gigs of RAM, 64 gigs of storage, uh, full Windows. Um, I believe this version actually comes with. Microsoft Office 2013, and uh, yeah, there you go. Runs Windows 8 apps, Metro apps, and everything. So this is Brad Linder with a first look at the Asus Transformer Book T100.